Yo guys, what's going on? It's Dom back here for another video. Basically today I got a new video for you guys. Um, it's a little different. I'm in a different car. I wanted to show you guys this. It's really cool. So basically guys, what I'm in right now is an Acura MDX. For right now where I am, it is unreleased. So I'm gonna show you guys a little bit about the car, show you the cool things, um, the bad things, even though there's really not any bad things about this car. I'm basically gonna show you guys all that and then have a zero to 60 somewhere throughout the video if you guys wanna see how fast it is, which for an SUV and what it is. And when I'm about to tell you what it is, you're gonna be like, oh wow. It doesn't compete with the X3M, the X5M, none of that yet, none of the inline sixes, but what Acura did with this car is really, really good. And it's really, really actually luxury, guys. I'm gonna show you everything everything about it i know i've seen a lot of people talking about this car it is the type s if you guys know what that is but a lot of people talk about this car so i'm going to show you guys everything about it the car version already came out so this is the suv version the mdx so i'm going to hop out even though it is currently snowing where i live well it's like flurrying icy i'm going to hop out and uh show you guys everything about the car all right guys so before i even hop out let me show you this is the interior of the car um, just from like a first person point of view, the interior during the day, um, is nothing compared to the interior during the night. It has all the trim lights at nighttime, which they come on automatically, which that's how basically all trim lights work in most of these cars. The trim light is followed by this awesome looking stitching here with the entire center console. The gearing is but push button, which was already uh, introduced in the Acura. So nothing like, none of this is new, but it does have the big old screen that comes. The, the gauge cluster is completely digital, which is really nice. It has a lot going on up here with the heads up display. So this is the advanced package. So it comes with all that. That, but i'm just showing you guys basically over the interior wireless charging you know we got more usb right here and usb c for the newer phones so as the newer cars come out you know it comes out with the new features it has paddle shifters it is a 10 speed transmission which is pretty insane so for the back seat it also has trim lights on the door this interior is really nice it is the mdx so it has three third row seating Ooh. The full roof, sun and moon roof up here, which is really, really nice, especially at nighttime. But I'm going to go ahead and hop out of the car now and show you guys on the outside. So as I'm hopping out, you can see it says Type S right there. So you guys get to see that, which is nice. It illuminates at night. So guys, this is the color that this one came in, which I really, really like, especially because I obviously like blue cars. My car's blue, too. You know, you have the Type S badging all over the car, which is really nice. And I'm sure the first thing that you see on this is it has Brembo brakes. That is extremely good. I mean, I don't really know why they have Brembos on this car. It goes quick, but not that quick. But anyway, these are the wheels that come on the, um, I'm sure you can get, you can get different style wheels, but this is the wheels that came on this one. It is the Advance. It has the quad exhaust tips, which is really nice. Doesn't sound crazy or anything like that, but it definitely is a really good look at nighttime you can see the taillights are very sleek but as you can see it is super handling all-wheel drive the the traction everything about this car is insane so yeah guys like i said it's the mdx so it has third row seating and all of that the new led lights that came out in 2022 the acuras uh the mdx's and the rdx's got the um the new front end so they have the nice sleek looking lights like i said the type s badge is all over this car front grille looks insane big old acura emblem but yeah guys the way this car really looks is, is i really really like it it's extremely comfortable uh easy to drive very smooth you barely can tell how fast you're going um until you look up at your nice uh heads up display so yeah guys i'm gonna open this door up for you guys you can see the interior you know you got the nice wood with these insanely loud els studio speakers these speakers are really loud guys really really loud i don't want to get copyrighted or else i would show you but just trust me on that back seat like i said it's nice it's even got the whole nine yards with the thermostat just as well two usb cords plenty of space and third row seating but there's stuff back there right now so yeah guys it is kind of snowing out here and i don't want to rush too much but you know i basically showed you guys over the entire car <laughs> look at all the snow in my hair oh my god if you would like to see anything in specific just comment it down below or go over to my instagram and just dm me but yeah guys basically that is uh, everything on the outside of the car and everything on the inside of the car you know i'm just getting into the car reviews so you know nothing crazy but i basically wanted to give you guys basically like an overlook just like kind of like what i did with my car 
Alrighty, so I also wanted to show you guys, like I said, it has the heads up display with the completely digital dash, big old screen with the keypad down here. The best thing of, that my most favorite thing about this car is it literally has not heating and air conditioning, which, you know, a lot of cars have that, which is also really cool, but it also has massaging seats. And if you hold this in, it'll pop up. There's th three or four different massages you can get. Mine right now is on this one. So this is like the pattern that it massages you in, as you can see. And then if you go like to wave, it'll show you a massage like that and so on and so forth. Also guys, it has the heated steering wheel, which is really nice. Um, one of my friend's moms actually recently just got a Range Rover. Yeah, the price of Range Rovers is literally like over 100K. For this car being like 75K before taxes, um, I think it's a very good deal. You get a lot of stuff with this car. Even my buddy, he said this is literally nicer than his mom's Range Rover. So if you were wondering, this is a V6. It is a turboed V6, makes 355 to the crank, 355 horsepower. It is all wheel drive, so it's pretty quick. I'll insert a zero to 60 clip now for you guys to see. So yeah, guys, it's pretty quick. It doesn't really compete with the um, with like the BMW SUVs and everything like that yet, but Acura did really good with this car. Maybe in the future, they can make it even a little tad faster. But for what it is and how heavy it is and, and for who's gonna be driving this type of SUV, it's, it's plenty fast enough. You can actually hear the turbo when you're driving in sports mode. It sounds really good. Unlike the car version of this, the Acura TLX Type S, the TLS or the TLX, excuse me, actually has a full exhaust system, a uh, sporty exhaust system where it kind of burbles and kind of pops and like sounds good when you start it. This one's kind of, this car kind of focuses more on the luxury things. I mean, it's literally massaging me as I speak to you guys. So, but yeah, it still sounds good. Everything about it, this car is really good. If you, like I said, if you guys have any questions, just comment them down below or hit me up on Instagram. I'll give you guys more videos in this car or anything you guys want to see. But you guys, make sure to stick around and subscribe. Plenty of car content coming soon. Just strolling back into this slowly. Just trying to produce some good content. Um, I'm going to drive around a little bit. I'll get a few clips for you guys. And uh, yeah, have a good day. Please subscribe, like the video. Here we are. I'm going to see if we can hear the turbo a little bit, guys. Yep. All right, guys, we are leaving the parking lot that I went to. A little low-key spot back here. I'm going to see if we can hear the turbo a little bit. Oh, yeah. Little driving point of view for you guys. It is in sports mode. I'll tell you what, it's extremely smooth to drive. Oh yeah, guys, it pulls, man. You can hear the turbo. I don't know if you can hear it on video, but in person, you can really hear the turbo. Even though it's like snowing slash raining right now, it is extremely good handling. Obviously, the super handling all-wheel drive. Like I said, it's a 10-speed transmission, so... I mean, it's really good with uh, when it comes to shifting on its own. But yeah, guys, I hope you guys liked this video. That was a little driving. I'm going to go ahead and go to my friend's house.